high saying that it's given to us to draw this pinch fit cap and uh, as you can see what we have to do first we have to know what is our dimension so our dimensions are in millimeters so you can come back here and then you say new sketch metric standard millimeter and then you go create so once you're here you can start first by drawing your lines for guidance so that is my first line okay which is vertical one and now i'm gonna come for my horizontal line so there is my horizontal line okay and i need to make sure that uh, my horizontal line is perpendicular to my horizontal to my vertical line and i need to drag it back there so once i have those ones i'm gonna now start with the circle so i need my first circle now my second circle this is my second circle so here i come with dimensions that's one need to be 80 millimeters so that's need to be 80 and the second one here need to be 55 millimeters so that's one need to be 55 millimeters so once i have this one i'm gonna come for the rectangle so i need my first rectangle here right i need my second rectangle here okay this is my second rectangle so i need to make sure about the dimensions of my rectangle that's one they needs to be uh, 65 millimeters so that needs to be 65 millimeters from here up to the that one need to be 32 enough that need to be 32 enough so 32.5 okay 32.5 and uh, those one here from the up to the that one need to be one enough one enough so that's one need to be one enough and this whole thing here need to be three millimeter that need to be three millimeters so i need to drag this line back there thank you so once i have that one in place i need to make sure about the dimension this dimension from the up to the that one day need to be 55 oh that was close right that was really really close that needs to be 55 millimeters and again i need to drag this line back come on back here okay so once i have those ones now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna have to trim so i'm gonna trim this part here i'm gonna trim i'm gonna delete this part and i'm gonna trim this one as well i'm gonna trim the trim here cancel so i'm gonna have i just have to delete it so i'm gonna delete that one day i'm gonna delete this one as well and i'm gonna trim this and that then I come here, I trim that part, I trim that part. So anything that I don't want, I'm gonna have to trim it. So I trim the I come there as well. I trim that one, I trim this one, I trim that one. Alright. So knowing that uh, everything is fine now, so that's what I don't need. Knowing that everything is fine now, so what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna have to go in 3D model. What is that? I'm gonna have to go in 3D model and uh, extrude my sketch. So now I say extrude, I come here, and then I say, as per my drawing, it needs to be extruded closer to me by 55 millimeters and far from me by 20 millimeters. So that is correct. So I come back the I say sketch visibility on. <coughs> Once I put the visibility on, I now need to extrude so i want to extrude that spot there and the spot here now by 25 millimeters and that tend to go both sides of the center line okay which is great okay so now i'm gonna have to change my drawing plane so i go for x y drawing plane then i come here i want it to go by zero there i say okay then i come here I say new sketch and I come here I say again slice graphic so once I say slice graphic I come to side here so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna start with a rectangle I think that's gonna be easier so I'm gonna draw a rectangle okay so there is my rectangle right and after that I'm gonna come with this line come on with this line so there is my line and i need to make sure now 
as said by my sketch so from V up to V that one needs to be 45 degrees so that needs to be 45 degrees okay and again I need to make sure that this line is there that's one needs to be 45 degrees that's one need to come there all right so I come and I trim this part here I trim this part now I need to make sure that this one day from the up to the that's one they need to be 40 millimeters so that needs to be four zero so four zero thank you so once i have that one in place i can come and bring this one back there on this one as well and thus back here okay this one back there come on and this one back here okay so now I can come with this other line so this is my line it starts from there mm, come on it starts from here and then it goes there and uh, yeah so once I have that one in place I can now delete this one so I can delete that one I can delete this one here I can delete this one as well and I can trim this part here. I can trim that part Cancel. So I think we can trim that part there. I can trim this part. I can trim that part as well. Okay. So now I can go on 3D model. I say extrude. So now I want to extrude this part here. I want to extrude that part. Okay. So I want to extrude, let's say, by uh, 100. It's fine. Both sides. Let's make it 200. That's safer for us. 200. Then I want to cut it. So I say, okay. So look how our drawing looks like now. So then I come here. I come here. And I need to have my circle. So I'll say, I come here and say, new sketch. So from there, I start with the circle. So that's why I need to start from there. That's my first circle. And that is my second circle. And according to the sketch, that's one they need to be uh, eight millimeter, eight millimeter. And this other one need to be twelve millimeter. That's one need to be twelve millimeter. The twelve, nah. Pam pam. Twelve millimeter. So once that is done, what I'm gonna do is I go 3D model, I say extrude. So I need now to extrude this part here. I need to extrude that part. Two hundred is fine passing through okay like that I say okay then I come here visibility on visibility on I need to restore this part here so I need to cut I need to have a step there of eight millimeters so eight cut inside I say okay so yeah what I'm gonna do next I'm gonna have to Put the visibility off so that's one need to be off this one here need to be off the plane need to be uh, off and that is great so now I come the side so I say that's part D and and this part here need to have a chamfer not a chamfer need to have a fillet of 12 and half. That part. No, 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 no. Sorry, that is not a part. So this part here. So it's this part as well as that part. This part here as well as that part. You need to have a fillet of 12 and half. 12 and half. That's great. And this one here, that one, as well as this one here need to have a fillet of 12 millimeters so great so now you can see this is how it looks like so i come now the side so i need to have a fillet that day as well as day and at the back as well so this side as well as that side a fillet of two millimeters so two millimeter that's great so once I have this one, I think our drawing is finished.
So you can see how beautiful your drawing looks like. So the next, that you, the next thing that you can do is maybe to change the material. You can put it the material that you want. Okay, so I can go for carbon steel. What is carbon steel? Come on. Carbon steel. Mm, carbon steel. That's great. So it was a pleasure of mine sharing this video with you. I hope that you enjoyed it. I hope that you're going to enjoy it. From now, I'm going to ask you to take care of yourself and see you on the next video. So, Bye. Take care.